Alright guys, so come back today. Today I want to talk about Guru's move set. Well, it's not out yet, so, you know, at a time I'm speaking, you know, like, or uploading this video. So, you know, so far, um, let's see, we got the grab move, right? So, like, you grab, slam them down, punch them a bunch of time, kick them in there, and, you know, fling them. Okay, that's cool. That's like a pretty good grab move. I, I, I don't know, I, I kind of like that. And then over here, we have the tsunami and the range attack. So, that's like three moves right now. And, you know, assuming that we're gonna get six moves, like, the rest. Uh, where was the first one? Oh yeah, it was over here. I skipped it. But yeah, it was spit, you know, crack in the air. I think you can charge that, I think. Huh. Like, it seems like you would be, like, charging it, so, like, you could be charging it. Oh. I mean, that's not so bad. Can you charge it with the range attack? I can't tell. Uh, I guess you can. Yeah, yeah, you can. You can, okay. You know, that's what it seems like in the video, but... Yeah, you should have, like, six moves, because right now I have Pika, you know. If it's, like, Phoenix or, like, whatever gravity, you know. It should have six moves, so... Yeah, I'm gonna head over to the wiki. Do you wanna check out like these, yeah, animation slash your moves yourself? I'll leave um, I'll leave a Discord link in the description, you know, as well as as the wiki, wiki, you know. Um, yeah, I wanna wanna hold on. All right, guys, I'm back. I did pause for a moment. Um, but anyways, we're at the wiki. Yes. You know, just gonna look at the usage and like the moves, right? So basically, like this whole paragraph, you know, like I guess like this is like you know, sea quake, right? I guess that's a technique, and that summons the tsunami. So we have that. You know, it's not blockable. Well, un yeah, it's not blockable. Literally, it says, okay, so we're not gonna be able to block the tsunami. Oh no, how do you escape from it? Like, oh, uh, Lamal, Gepo. Oh no, Sursa user, he's sad. But yeah, um... Okay, like, that's the tsunami move for like the first paragraph, right? And the next one is, you know, a close range variation of... Um, I don't know what this... I, I... I don't remember One Piece much anymore, like, I know I've seen White Bear, but like... Yeah, I need to rewatch, basically. Um, I like, I don't know much about White Bear besides like what I'm reading right now from the wiki, so... Yeah, so... Crack in the front of the enemy, so alright, that's in the close range move basically. And then like over here is like where it gets like a little bit confusing, cause let's see, White Bear focuses vibration around his fist in a spherical bubble to form earthquake, hypo count center, what? I I don't know. Big words, big words. <laughs> but basically you make bubble to do extra damage. That's how I see it, you know? So Yep, um, and then like, let's see, over here, it's just like, Wavy grabs his opponent, like his head, and concentrate his vibration around it. Um, like, instead of delivering punches, so like, this is not like the um, animation that we're getting. No, not like the, um, this punch combo? It, it, do I cry, call this a punch combo, or um, what will combo? A grab combo? Yeah, you know, um, it's not like that, so like, you, know, you punch them a bunch of time in the animation, so this move is not it. I don't know if this is gonna be in the game, but who knows, you know? Um, all I know that like you know, making bubble on your enemy isn't a thing right now, so that might be a thing in the future. I don't know, maybe when they make them. And then like over here, yeah, um, we have the mowing blade. I guess that's like the technique. I don't know. <laughs> But basically, White Bear uses his sword, right, you know, swing, you know, epic power, you know, yay, quick bubble on his, huh, sword. I guess, like, maybe we get his sword, right, we can use his move, yeah. with Goro to, like, increase his power and stuff, so that's super nice, it's like gravity display, you know, if you have gravity display with gravity, you know, you're like a vacuum, sucks fuel in, and, you know, grab his slash, dumb, you know, yeah, it's like a vacuum rapid slash. You know, that makes any sense, right? But yeah, that would be interesting uh, to see, I guess. Hopefully, like, if we get the White Bear Sword. Hopefully. Because, like, it is like a long weapon, so, like. I wonder how that's gonna work, right? Uh, 
Yeah, um... Yeah, and it, assuming it has two moves, like Gravity Play, right? What's the other move gonna be? Like, what, make the bubble instead? Like, if, if the sword makes the bubble instead, I'll be like, okay, I can see why, because you, technically, like, you're putting bubble on the blade to increase its power. But I would think you can only do that with Goro. So I don't know. Uh, well, there's two moves, so, you know, I mean, it's gonna at least have, like, an attack move, where it's, like, you know, the mowing blade, I guess we we'll just call it. So. That's it. That would be interesting, you know. Uh, we'll see. <laughs> oh no, and then like... <coughs> but yeah, um... And then over here, we have like, island shaking, so we don't have this yet, so... I guess maybe this could be like a stun move? You know, you stun your opponent, I guess? You know... I mean, there's really not much to say. You shake the entire island, maybe you do damage with it? Oh wait, that could be the last move, instead of the Tsunami. I know the Tsunami is OP, but like... Island Shaking sounds more OP, you know? Since... what does it say? Um... No, that's like... okay... Let's see... Um, he just shifts the island. That's basically it. Yeah, I guess like, it would either do damage or like, stun you. That would make sense to me, you know? Um, who knows? If we get like the um, island shaking move, but over here is like video games only attack, which is you know the range move, like send sending um, waste vibration at his opponents. So like we have that already. So it was from you know, video games only attacks, and then I assume you know the animation that we have, not to confuse anyone, you know the grab combo. Um, it's like silent rage. It says. White Bear charges power into his hand, then punch his opponent, smashing them down, smashing them into ground. Well, do you punch them here? No, you just grab them immediately, then like smash them into ground. So I guess that's a little bit different, but whatever, you know? I mean, maybe it could be based on this last move. I just assume, because they're like very similar. But yeah, it says smashing them into the ground, unleashing vibration, so like, we don't have the animation, like particle. Not animation. But yeah, um, we don't have the particles yet. But basically, yeah, you you smash it in the ground, give them vibration, shake them a bunch of times, yay, amazing. Yeah, that's what Guru does, shakes people, amazing. Then attacks the opponent with his what now? Not what? I guess is that his sword? Please tell me that's his sword, right? I don't know. Um Let's see. I don't know if that's his sword, my bad. Like, if I, I don't know what this means. I don't know, like... Uh, that's not what his sword is called, right? Um, it's like Bish, Bishinto? I don't know, like, that's what it's called, but I don't know this word. Whatever, you know, you, you punch them a bunch of time. You know, before flaying them into the air. You know, finally pulling back his arm. Oh wait, pulling back his arm. Okay, I guess the animation doesn't do that, so like, over here... Yeah, like, you do fling them, right? And then, like, launch them away. But, like, over here, like, you grab his arm, like... The grabbing arm part, you know, and punching is, like, together. Well, I guess it's, like, a little bit different than this. Maybe, like, the move could still be based on this. I don't know, um... Someone told me it was, like, based on Attack on Titan, I think. Yeah, um... I don't even know anymore. Send help. You know, like, there's like a bunch of moves. I don't know. But yeah, um, here's like, I, I like read this, read these quickly earlier. But basically, it's like grab combos. Yeah. <laughs> Where it grabs the air, you know, pulls it downward. Once it gets low enough, all its potent are tossed into the air and fall back down. So, yeah, that's kind of grab move. I mean, kind of, you know. But yeah. So, and then the next one, following a jump. Wipe your slam down the ground, send vibration. That's kind of boring actually. So like, it's like a landing move. I mean, you could have that kind of as like a passive, maybe? If that makes any sense. And, oh yeah, also I was reading earlier, where, where was it? I believe it says he has like a... Um... Oh yeah, Wiper could also passively summon the vibration around himself, which protect him from being frozen. So, I don't know, does this counter ice? Are we gonna have this passive? Don't really know, I'm just like, you know, speaking, you know, what Guru can do, like, 
It could literally counter ice. It is like how it is in the anime, I guess. So that's kind of interesting. Um, let me know what you guys think in the comments. You know, because um, I could be wrong about like you know making bubble and like shaking the, the island. I guess for like the next two moves. You know, for Guru Fruit. Yeah, that's what I think so far. Yeah, since we already have like those four moves already, besides. Like four moves are already made or shown at least. But yeah, yeah, that was that's interesting, you know. Um, uh, Jesus Christ, the ad was going up and down. Eh, whoa, 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 whoa! Yeah, it's scaring me. The ad is moving, you know. But yeah, anyways, I'm gonna have you guys enjoy your day, or I'll see you later, you know. Whatever. <laughs> bye, bye.